everyone welcome to the vlog and welcome to my channel welcome back it is 6 10 p.m thursday january 21st and i just straightened my hair last night i dyed it but this is what it looks like after it's straight i missed some spots up here so that's why i got two boxes i'll have to dye it again the dye actually went really fast but i also did my makeup today hopefully you can see it okay. I haven't done eye makeup in a while, so if it's bad, it's bad. I don't know. But I just wanted to show you what my hair looked like after I straightened it. It's getting pretty long. We haven't really done much today. It's been kind of a chill day. But I got... Hold on, let me check so I can give you an accurate number. I posted a vlog last night. I gained like three or four subscribers and 34 views as of last night. You cannot see that, but it says 34 views, but I'm really excited. The last video got 34 views since last night, and I'm really proud of that video. I worked really hard on it. I vlogged throughout a couple days, and I'm really enjoying vlogging, so thank you guys so much for watching. I don't know what the next clip will be, but I'm going to wrap up this clip. <laughs> Does anybody else watch Tara Michelle? Let me know if you do down in the comments. And if you don't, go check her out. I love her channel so much. So I was so excited to find these at my local Quick Trip. They are the Lady Gaga Oreos, and they tasted pretty good. They're just pink colored golden Oreo cookies with green colored cream. And I'll show you what they look like. Here is the heart print, and then the other side just says Oreo. I took these before I knew that they came in different prints, so there are a bunch of different kinds of cookies that you can get. Okay, so we're about to go to the store to grab a couple things. I will vlog inside the store. I'll try my best. Hopefully you can hear me, but I haven't posted a vlog in a minute. I had one done and I felt like I didn't want to post it because my lips were extremely chapped, but I made a poll on Instagram asking if I should still post it and most of the answers were yes. So. This is gonna be added to that, and we're just gonna make it kind of a super long vlog, and I will get that posted tonight or tomorrow, which tonight's like the 28th, 29th. If I'm wrong, I'll put it right here at the bottom of the screen, but I'll show you a little bit of the car ride, and then I'll show you when we get to Walmart. behind me please excuse that we went to walmart and we actually found this really cute sweater that i just had to get it is scooby-doo and it has crappy doo on it there's scooby-doo velma and shaggy and then we have daphne fred and scrappy doo and then on the sleeves we have fred daphne scooby and shaggy and the same on this arm I thought that was really cute and it came with a mask that I'll actually include a little clip of now. So we also got some Carmex because my lips have been super chapped and we got these rags and some towels to match. I absolutely love this color. It's like my all time favorite color. I'd say either this or purple, but here are the towels. They were super cute. The towels are only $2.74. And the rags were only $1.24, so super cheap. They're really thick and nice quality. They're pretty big, and I love the 
color of it and the lines the lines I love the color of it and the little pattern part they have on there so I got four of those and I got two rags and then I got this sweatshirt we also got the puppies a bone to share so or I'll show a clip of this stuff real quick so these are the Burt's Bees eye makeup remover pads and they have kiwi extract in them I got these Burt's Bees eye makeup remover pads and I'm gonna try them Real, tr real. I'm gonna try them real quick for you guys. I did put a little bit of makeup on, so we'll see how well they come off. Here's what the little pads look like. They have these little bumps on there, and let's give it a try. To be honest the makeup might have worn off already but as you can see it is getting what is left over on there and I didn't use a lot so there might not be a lot left on there as you can see it is getting it off I'm gonna grab a fresh one I think that took out took off all that was left on there I'm going to use one of these makeup wipes now, which I actually got at a store we have around here called Reesers. But they are a, I guess you would say, dupe for the Neutrogena wipes. They work just like them or the Great Value wipes from Walmart. They all pretty much work the same. Said, oh, I did want to read you on this bottle. It says, gently removes waterproof eye makeup. Unique shape reaches all corners of the eye. Moisturizing formula nourishes delicate skin. There's no oily residue, hyperallergenic, safe for contact lens wearers. And it says, gently wipe pad over closed eyelid until all makeup is removed. No need to rinse, use daily, and don't flush. I don't know if you can even see that, but I'm gonna remove the rest of my makeup and then I'm probably gonna go to bed. And this video will probably go up tomorrow after I get all the footage edited. See, these wipes work really, 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 really well, and they were only a couple dollars. There's all the makeup it removed. Now, I'm actually, I forgot to say that I'm actually going to wash my face, and then I'm going to get some sleep. So, I will say hi to you guys in the morning, probably take the Christmas tree down because we have not done that yet, and I will get this video up. Thanks, guys. So we just took the ornaments off the tree. A really cool Nintendo star to go on top of the tree. What are you doing, sweet pea? What are you doing, sweet pea? Hi! Hi, sweetie. Hi, sweetie. Oh! <laughs> Getting buried in my hair.